When I was just a lad, looking for my true vocation, my father said, now son, this choice deserves deliberation. Though you could be a doctor, or perhaps a financier, my boy, why not consider a more challenging career? Hey, ho, ho, you'll cruise the foreign shores. <laughs> See you, lads. Your mind and Show him he's practicing. Out of doors. True friendship and adventure are what we can't live without. And when you're a professional pirate, that's what the job's about. Upstage, lads. This is my only number. Now take Sir Francis Drake. The Spanish all despise him, but to the British he's a hero and they idolize him. It's how you look at buccaneers that makes them bad or good. And I see us as members of a noble brotherhood. Hup. Hey ho ho! Oh, I love on it. Honor it is poetry and, and before we lose our tempers, we will always count to ten. On occasion, there may be someone you have to execute. Ooh. But when you're a professional pirate, you don't have to wear a suit. What? I could have been a surgeon. I like taking things apart. I could have been a lawyer, but I just had too much heart. I could have been in politics, because I've always been a big spender. And me. I could have been a contender. <laughs> <laughs> Some say that pirates steal and should be feared and hated. I say we're victims of bad press. It's all exaggerated. We'd never stab you in the back. We'd never lie or cheat. We're just a bit the nicest guy you'd ever want to meet. <laughs> well, look at us, Jim. We're a festival of conviviality. <laughs> <laughs> conviviality.